at the Femacy Lighthouse pre-show on Instagram. That link is in the comments section. Let's get started. Spirit, please provide me with energies that surround Taurus in the recent past. Talk to me about someone that is thinking about Taurus in the recent past. We have the hermit energy coming out here first. So this is somebody that you haven't heard from, you haven't seen them. They are not around at this time. They could be at a distance. They feel the need to keep quiet, stay quiet. All right, I feel like they're not ready to be upfront about something. This is an energy that is hiding with the hermit presenting itself. Some of you dealing with a Virgo or a mutable sign, a Pisces, a Sagittarius. Tell me more. Talk to me about this individual. Okay, we have the death card coming out here. So they feel like something is no more. They are in their mind about the fact that something will not continue. I feel like you put a stop to whatever this is. You are choosing to go in a different direction. They know that. Um, they continue to watch you, I feel, okay? Because this is an energy that's thinking about you in the recent past. With the hermit mode, you know, they just don't want you to know that they're still very attentive to what it is that you're up to, but obviously we're exposing them here. Tell me more. Talk to me about the recent past. We have the death card, the hermit energy, Scorpio, Virgo. Yeah, we have Aries coming out here. So this is somebody that does not want the situation to be over, Taurus, okay? It's like you're in this Scorpio energy right now of, look, what's done is done. I don't care. You know, I just feel this energy from you where you're just telling somebody, look, it is what it is. <laughs> um, I'm not looking back, okay? You could have decided to just give up on something or end it, whatever it was, okay? This could have been a career. It could have been a habit. This could be a person. It depends on how you decide to interpret your own metaphor, right? But I feel like they still want something that they lost. Let's be very clear about that, right? Tell me more. Talk to me about this full energy. Who is this person? Spirit, who is this person, please? Tell me more about this Aries energy. Tell me more about this person. The Seven of Cups. The world, yeah. They know it's over. Who are all these people though, right? Talk to me about the Seven of Cups here. Who are all these people? Why do we have all of these people present in the recent past? Oh, okay. Oh, it's the people that surround the Hierophant. Ah, I see. I see. It's your notoriety. It's the fact that you're becoming more popular amongst people. And so they're watching that happen and they wanna take part in it. I feel like right now, somebody is realizing that they made a bad decision, okay? You are the one with all of these people around you, Taurus. So I don't know what you're up to or what's going on. I don't know if this is your family, if this is friends, if this is your fan base, but here you are, okay? Queen of Pentacles, getting her money, getting noticed by many people in your power, the Hierophant. This person is seeing that. It's making them anxious. They feel like there's something that they have to do about it, okay? Tell me more. Talk to me about the present. That was the recent past. Talk to me about the present. Talk to me about the present. The Knight of Pentacles energy to the star. I love this, Taurus. I'm telling you. I mean, this is something that we've been talking about for days now. I feel like you are becoming more popular. Some of you are going to be famous. 
I feel like a lot of you probably are already famous. I feel that you're just on the right path. The Knight of Pentacles to the star. So whatever it is that you have been manifesting, it's going to come true. It's going to take time, okay? But I don't feel like you're in a rush. You could feel it happening. You feel the pressure, the intensity of something big coming for you, okay? The star is present. I would love to show it to you, but I haven't drawn on the card yet. And obviously, you guys know that this person is naked in that card. And I don't want to get flagged, so I'm not going to show it to you. But the Knight of Pentacles to the star in the present moment, continue to focus on yourself, all right? I know you have a lot of people that are focused on you, but that's okay. Keep working. Keep pushing forward. Never mind the naysayers or the negativity. Tell me more. Talk to me about this star showing up here, Aquarius energy. Talk to me about the star that's showing up here. The Wheel of Fortune Taurus. Wow. It's like each reading that I do keeps getting even better and better. If you notice, right? If you watch me every day, it's like your future is looking amazing. Listen, if you disconnected from somebody, that's cool. It was meant to happen. You're on to bigger and better things here with the star and the wheel of fortune. That's why there's so many people here. It's like they're crowded around you, okay? You can feel the eyes on you. I feel like you know that there's a group that's talking about you. It's like um, people just want an opportunity or they want to have you be a part of their team in some way. It's something like that. Tell me more about the present. Talk to me about the present for Taurus. The emperor, yeah. The boss right now. The boss, Taurus. You know what I'm saying? You're doing a damn thing, okay? So if they're mad, you already know why. The magician, okay? <laughs> Listen, tell me more. Tell me more about the present. Four of Wands, it keeps getting better and better and better. Your life is going to keep getting better and better and better, Taurus. All right? It's your time. It's your time. I've been chanting this for the past three days. And I got to keep going because it's going to happen. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what your project is or what it is that you're manifesting. It's going to come true, Taurus. Please believe me. Talk to me about the future. Talk to me about the future for Taurus. Talk to me about the future. The Ace of Cups. Wow. All right, so Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, energy. This is success. In whatever capacity you want to put this in, I mean... This is you with high levels of achievement. This is trophies. You know what I mean? Something like that is taking place here in the future. Tell me more. Talk to me about the future. Seven of Swords. Hmm. Talk to me about that Seven of Swords. Who is that Seven of Swords? Let's have a different deck for that. Who is this Seven of Swords? Talk to me about the Seven of Swords in the future there. The Seven of Swords in the future. <laughs> Somebody still wants you. Somebody. Who is this person over here? Look, I know that this is a trophy for you, so you're winning at something here in the future, okay? I know that for a fact. But also, the Seven of Swords, right? This person is running away from a commitment or getting away from something that they did because they want to be with you, okay? That's another message that I'm getting. So you still don't trust this person and you still shouldn't trust this person. 
because they're still showing up with the seven of swords energy. All right. I do feel that you will be communicating with them though, because I got the eight of wands. So I see that happening. However, you're busy in the future there. Okay. You trying to get this trophy, right? Double meaning, double messages that I'm getting here where you're focused on the trophy, right? I feel like somebody is also running away from a commitment to come and get with you, all right? Or something like that. You're gonna talk to this person, but I don't know if things are gonna go farther, okay? Let's see what else we have. Talk to me about what Taurus should do in the future there. Talk to me about what Taurus should do. Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Knight of Swords. If you entertain this person that's doing this, whomever this is in your life, if you entertain them, okay, it's going to lead to the Nine of Swords, all right, the Knight of Swords, the Queen of Cups. And since you have all of these beautiful energies presenting themselves here, I don't want this person to hinder you, whomever they are, because you have so much potential in the present moment with the Four of Wands, the Magician, the Star, the Wheel of Fortune. You know? So it's like, Yes, you are going to find someone if you are looking for that. If this is in reference to you already being in a relationship, I feel that things are going to get better with you and that person. However, there's someone else that is returning, okay? Seven of Swords. And I feel like you're not supposed to entertain this person. It's going to be up to you. But this person sees you doing really well or something like that. And they just want to pull up. Hmm. Tell me more. Let's just do a spread really quick on love. Spirit, talk to me about love really quick for Taurus. What can Taurus expect? Page of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, it doesn't have to be a fire sign. However, when it comes to your love situation, there's some type of message that's coming towards you or someone is reaching out in the future because this image indicates that someone wants to talk to you. Tell me more. Talk to me about love when it comes to Taurus. Why do we have the Page of Wands? Who is this person that wants to talk to Taurus? Okay, yeah, it's someone that you are walking away from or that you already walked away from. That person is returning. Same message with the Seven of Swords. That person is returning, Taurus. You know, I know that some of you don't want a past person to return or a past situation, but they want to talk. You are walking away. I see you leaving somebody. Tell me more about that Eight of Cups. Yeah, you're over here like, nah, I'm gone. Tell me more. The Lovers, Gemini Energy. Wow, tell me more about that. The Queen of Pentacles and the Lovers together. Capricorn energy though, all right? So you wanna keep that in mind, all right? I see you talking to somebody in the future. I see them coming back around, but I still feel like someone is toxic here. That's what I'm getting. But you're talking to them. I see that. You will be communicating with them. They wanna talk to you. Page of Wands to the Eight of Cups. You are turning your back on the person that wants to talk to you. There's potential 
for you turning back around to communicate with this person. I'm just warning you before it happens. All right, that's what I have for you, Taurus. To book a private session, all of that info is below. Take care.